The AOAA played host to the Coal Mountain Jeep Jamboree USA event Thursday through Saturday. This is our eighth year. We started here in 2012 uh, with a sold out event and we've sold out every year. Uh, now we're doing two events a year. Uh, so this is our 12th Jamboree here on this property in eight years. We got uh, 150 some Jeeps from uh, uh 17 different states plus uh two canadian territories well it's our first time doing this so even just uh getting out in the bush um cutting through the trees and stuff like that it's uh it's it's been a good time so the trail guide's really good he's informative and making sure we keep the rubber down and the roof rack up the goal is to take people out to experience uh off-road what their jeeps are capable of doing you know uh, we have beginners to very experienced people uh, and uh, it's just get an opportunity to get out in the woods amongst nature I've had a jeep with my dad for two years now I think that's what it equivalents to and my dad was talking about it before Christmas and this was my gift to him so we're up here for a Christmas trip Best Christmas gift ever. But we chat constantly, so oh it's it's God. three hours stuck in a Jeep together. There's some parts where it's a little slow, but that it's definitely worth the wait because then you get to a part or a big mud hole or a downslide, and you'll start shifting. And it's it's really fun. I recommend it for anybody that wants to come out. It's very challenging, and on the other hand, it's rewarding. Also, uh, we're having a lot of fun. There's different terrain, mud, rocks. You know, there's even some. You know, just uh, ordinary gravel driving.